वेलकम टू द चैनल इन दिस वीडियो वी आर लुकिंग एट द सिम्यूलेशन ऑफ रेजिस्टिव रैम विद वन ट्रांजिस्टर यूजिंग केडेंस वर्चुअसो सो द रेजिस्टिव रैम इज हैविंग ए मेटल इंसुलेटर मेटल स्ट्रक्चर इट इज जनरली रेफर टू एज एम आई एम स्ट्रक्चर सो यू कैन सी देर इज अ टॉप इलेक्ट्रोड ऑफ मेटल देर इज अ बॉटम इलेक्ट्रोड ऑफ मेटल एंड इन बिटवीन देर इज अ मेटल ऑक्साइड so this is the insulating layer so this is the top electrode bottom electrode and in between the insulating layer so the insulating layer will have a conducting filament formed when we apply a voltage so let us see how that is done so the operation of the resistive ram is basically in two states one is called the low resistance state or lrs and the other is called high resistance state or hrs so the application of the external voltage pulse will enable a transition from lrs to hrs and vice versa so first let us look at the set operation so if the ram is initially in the high resistance state then there will be no conducting filament or no conducting path in the oxide so to switch from the hrs to the lrs we apply a high voltage that will enable the form formation of conducting path in the oxide layer and the ram will be switched to lrs so this process is called as electroforming and this operation is called as set operation in which we switch the device from hrs to lrs so you can see if we apply a voltage at the top electrode initially there will be no conducting filament but if we apply a voltage at the top electrode this conducting path will be formed and it will switch from high resistance state to low resistance state so in the low resistance state the current can flow from the top electrode to the bottom electrode through the conducting path this is called as set operation when we switch from high resistance state to low resistance state then the reset operation is just opposite to it in the reset operation we apply a reset voltage which enables the switching from low resistance state to high resistance state it is just opposite of the set operation so this resistive ram is a non volatile memory because the lrs and hrs these resistance values will retain their value even after the removal of the applied voltage so let us switch to the cadence and see the operation so this is the circuit so this is the drain of the transistor the drain of the transistor is connected to bottom electrode the source is grounded the gate is connected to the word line voltage and this top electrode is connected to this voltage so we have applied a pulse voltage so first we are doing a set operation so in set operation we will apply a 2 volt pulse and this word line voltage is a pulse of 1.28 volt so let us jump into the analysis so first we are doing the set operation so we will load this state so we are doing a transient analysis so we are plotting the current and the word line voltage and the this voltage so we will run the analysis let me check and save this so as you can see in the set operation the current is switching from 0 to about 110 microampere so this is the set operation when the current switches from 0 to 110 microampere so this is called as the low resistance state now let me make this voltage as negative so 
to do the reset operation we have to apply a negative voltage just the opposite polarity again check and save again we will run this so first we did the set operation by applying a positive voltage now we are applying a voltage of opposite polarity so now you can see the current that is flowing is just 7 micro ampere or 8 micro ampere so in the reset operation the current is just 8 micro ampere and in the set operation the current is 100 and 10 micro ampere so this reset state is also called as the zero state and the set state is also called as the one state or logic high state so thank you please like and share the video and subscribe the channel